for us and and like on the left there we're seeing what you're calling the broken heart the normal heart is on what are we what are we looking at I can see what's happening in the normal heart what what are you doing there perfect so these are uh, from the uh, catheterization laboratory and we have a catheter coming up through the femoral artery down to the leg and the catheter then goes across the aortic valve into the main pumping chamber of the heart mm -hmm. and on the broken heart you can see how the tip of the heart really is not contracting well. It's just sort of sitting there. It's, uh, we call it akinetic. The normal heart, you can see how the chamber squeezes nice, contracts. The whole chamber contracts efficiently and uh, forcefully. So is, that, is the broken heart just working overtime? Is that, uh, it looks like it's pumping a lot. Well, the, the uh, base, of, on, on here, the base of the heart, happening? the base of the heart has to compensate because the tip, as you saw, here's the main, uh, pumping chamber here, the left ventricle, mm -hmm. the tip is not functioning correctly. And so the, the basal constrictors, the base of the heart has to compensate for, for the dysfunction. Oh my goodness. So, so what are some of the symptoms someone might feel if they've, they think they have a broken heart, <laughs> literally? Well, the, 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 this typically mimics a, uh, um, a heart attack. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So it, it's triggered by emotional or physical stress. You may have chest discomfort. You can develop heart failure from it, shortness of breath. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And uh, typically happens in women. Men, really? of course, can always have a broken heart as well. Sure. It can occur in men, but typically older women. for us and and like on the left there we're seeing what you're calling the broken heart the normal heart is on what are we what are we looking at I can see what's happening in the normal heart what what are you doing there perfect so these are uh, 
in, from the uh, catheterization laboratory, and we have a catheter coming up through the femoral artery down to the leg, and the catheter then goes across the aortic valve into the main pumping chamber of the heart. Mm -hmm. And on the broken heart, you can see how the tip of the heart really is not contracting well. It's just sort of sitting there. It's, uh, we call it akinetic. The normal heart, you can see how the chamber squeezes nice, contracts. The whole chamber contracts efficiently and uh, forcefully. So is, that, is the broken heart just working overtime? Is that, uh, it looks like it's pumping a lot. Well, the the uh, Show base us on, on here the base of the heart happening. the base of the heart has to compensate because the tip, as you saw, here's the main uh, pumping chamber here, the left ventricle. Mm -hmm. The tip is not functioning correctly, and so the the basal constrictors, the base of the heart, has to compensate for for the dysfunction. Oh my goodness! So so what are some of the symptoms someone might feel if they've they think they have a broken heart, <laughs> literally? Well, the, the the this typically mimics a uh, um, a heart attack. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So it, it's triggered by emotional or physical stress. You may have chest discomfort. You can develop heart failure from it, shortness of breath. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And uh, typically happens in women. Men, really? of course, can always have a broken heart as well. Sure. It can occur in men, but typically older women. Simply to keep him in the game, John's heart and lungs are working at their limit. But by doing so, they're placing him in mortal danger. Blood is being forced faster and faster through his diseased coronary arteries. Flowing at five times their normal speed, blood cells eddy and swirl around his plaques. Bombarded by red blood cells, one fragile plaque is under unbearable strain. Its thin membrane is ripped open. Within moments, blood cells start to clot around the rupture. Anywhere else in John's body, this clotting response might save his life. But here, in his narrow artery, the effect is quite the opposite. The clot in John's artery traps more and more passing blood cells. It grows bigger, and the flow of blood to John's heart slows down. Downstream, the heart muscle cells are in peril. Their oxygen supply is dwindling just when they need it most. His starving cells send pain signals to his brain. But John has never experienced pain from his heart before. To him, it feels just like indigestion. During your lunch too fast, John. Perhaps the old man better off in gold. He has no idea that this is the start of a heart attack. The growing clot is now blocking two-thirds of his artery. John's indigestion is getting worse. He feels a vice-like pain in his left arm. His brain is confused, overloaded with the escalating pain signals coming from his heart. For the first time in his life, the regular beat of John's heart is under threat. A patch of four million muscle cells is running low on oxygen. John, what's up? What's the matter? Five minutes after his heart attack began, John's body is struggling to deal with the crisis.
Okay. Uh, uh, Father Misha, okay. anong pangalan? Rogelio Gabriel po. Okay, uh, anong naging sakit niya? Ano po, na-stroke po siya. Na-stroke nung okay. kailan? Nung Friday po. Friday, ano nangyayari sa kanya? Uh, na, na, hindi niya makalakad? Hindi na po. Hindi na makalakad? At okay. uh, salita? Hindi rin po. Eh, nagkailan kayo nagpunta rito? Nung Sabado po. Kinabukasan? Opo. Okay, ngayon ito, ano ngayon? Lunes, di ba? Opo. Ano ang development sa kanya? Ano po, nakakalakad na po siya. Nakakalakad? Ah, Opo, oh. yung pagsasalita niya po ayos na po. Oh, pwede ba natin pagsalitain? Opo. Bro, Sige, pwede ka magsalita? Hindi, hindi. Oh, ilawan mo ha? Ano? Uy! <laughs> Kasama yung pala anak na maganda eh. <laughs> okay ah. Nung, nung last Saturday, gumagapang kayo. Dalawa pa alala ya. Ha? Ayos. Ha? O sige, susunod. After two weeks, magjajag. sa product kaya mabilis din ko ba rin? Ang isa niya yung mga 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 Ngayon po, kung saan mo pagkakaroon mo? 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 Ito po ba yung therapy kay Abiso? Sa Abiso? Okay. 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 Sige nga po, kumain po kayo para makita ng ating mga kaibigan o kababaya. Ako ay masigla na po talaga itong taong ito. Dati po yung driver, stroke na yung mukhang... Kaya katibayan po ng taong ito ay talagang napagaling na abiso willingness. Technology ng ating inventor na si Engineer Abiso Uh, Ito ang isang parang ng Yan lang po. Ah, maraming salamat.